Hey, I'm gonna give you a really quick overview of Nota Bene, which is the quickest way to take a note to self, um, send a note to an assistant, or do whatever you need else you need to do. Um, so here, I'm just typing a note out, I open my composer, I'm gonna hand it to self, and boom, you'll see it show up in a second. Um, audio recording super valuable, so you can literally just hit record, you start saying stream of consciousness, what's on your mind, what you wanna remember, a really interesting conversation, whatever, you hit send, uh, I'll send this case to Trello just for the sake of demonstration. I can go ping pong, uh, hello, and I also add a note, you know, note on top of that. So I'm speaking and expressing some stuff with a note. I hit send. I'll send this to Evernote just for the sake of demonstration. Those all just dash off um, and you're done. And it's the quickest way to kind of basically open a composer easily from the dock and, and just get a note off your mind to whoever needs to, to process it, whether it's you or someone else. So there it comes. You see over here, it came into my email. Here it is in Trello, the transcription as well as the recording. Uh, there you go in Evernote. So you basically get the point, which is um, you just open it and you send. Now, I personally use a bunch of different lists I send to a bunch and people, so I can make a fin request, um, you know, lion memory. I use, I send my, uh, thoughts to my, my young son's journal. So, you know, when he does something important or cute or a milestone. Uh, Co-founders, app endpoints, self is probably the one I use the most because I'm a big self note taker, my wife. Etc. Um, you can figure these basically by just adding a recipient group, who you want to send to, multiple email addresses, a nickname for it, a prefix for the subject, some post fixes in the in the in the body and the footer, and then it's a few key options about location and uh, transcription. But that's basically it. I mean, you know, my biggest suggestion is you leave it in your doc, and now you have a composer you open to is the fastest way to take and dash off a note. So you check it out; it's pretty good.